Hello, Karen from Karen Co Creative here. If you're new to me in the channel, we do both done for you and DIY websites and all manner of online business systems, everything you need to run your business online if you are a service provider. Sorry, I'm talking very quickly. And today we have a quick tutorial just showing you how to create a pop up on your WordPress website if you have ConvertKit. So I'll take you over my shoulder and we'll do that. Sorry, a little bit of a cold today, so you might hear that in my voice. Um, so if we're looking to set up a pop up on a WordPress website, there is a ConvertKit plugin. Um, so to find that, if you don't already have it, you would go to your plugins, add new, and you would type in ConvertKit. But this is the one that we want. Um, don't be confused, this one has the same symbol. We want the ConvertKit email marketing. So if you did not already have this, you would hit install now and then activate. Once it's active, you will see it most easily here in your plugins list. So if you go to settings, this is where you'll connect it to your ConvertKit account. It's taking a minute. So see here, it's asking for the API key and the API secret key. You won't be able to see stuff to the right here because I will have that blurred out. To get this, you need to come to your ConvertKit account um, and go to settings. And then all the way down here to advanced. And this is where you would find your API key and you would copy and paste it. Again, you won't be able to see this one, it will blurred out and then there'll be a button here show. If you click this, you will get your secret API key. You need to copy and paste that in as well because this asks for both. Once you've done that, what you need to do is you can do refresh the page and then you'll be able to find all of your forms in here. So you'll want to create a convert kit pop up. So if you don't already have that done, you'll want to make sure you come to landing pages and forms. Create a new form. And you want to do the modal here because this is the pop up version. So you'll create this form if you don't already have one styled. And then once you have that done, you might refresh your page again, and then you'll see it here. Um, so you would select the pop up. And I like to do posts and pages, but not products. Then you hit save changes. Wait for it. Then if we visit the site, we should see it come in the bottom left. There it is. Um, so it pops up here. Um, if you're not seeing it, if you're not, on, if you are on your email list, you may need to go to an incognito window to see it pop up. To do that, you would come over here and hit new incognito window in Chrome is the easiest way to do that. And that way it'll, the fact that you are you with your email address will be hidden. All right. So that is how super fast you can add a pop-up to your WordPress website. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to drop a like on it and you can always subscribe to the channel so you don't miss a feature tutorials. All right. Thanks for being here. Bye.